I'm Casey Donovan, together with Amy Malloy. Thank you for joining us once again in The Space, a mindfulness podcast that's not like the others. Every Thursday, our topic is all about you, with mindfulness tips to feel like your best self. Tonight, we're going to go in a different direction. What if you don't feel your best, and that's okay too? It's a topic that Matt Haig, the author of The Comfort Book, raised on his Instagram. One day he posted five words. I have anxiety right now. It's okay. I'm okay, he said. But today, I have anxiety. I've been overthinking and overworking and undersleeping. But I'm fine. It no longer feels like a failure or a descent like it used to. I no longer panic it up into a frenzy. It is like an injury that flares up from time to time, shared Matt. Allow yourself not to be 100% well. This isn't a test. Unsurprisingly, that post got a lot of attention and praise. There's a big relief in calling out your anxiety. No judgment. No fighting. No running away from it. It also raises a hot topic. It's something that we can all try when we're feeling anxious. When you're having those feelings, call yourself out. I'm feeling anxious today. I'm feeling it, not I am it. Today, not forever. Say it aloud and don't keep it a secret. Know it will come and go like an old injury. Just like an injury, there are things you can do to help yourself. You know it by now or listen back to our catalogue. Don't roll your eyes. These things really help. Simple stuff like respect your boundaries, eat well, move your body, get creative, breathe deeply, laugh at yourself or laugh at a Netflix show. If you're feeling anxious today, we challenge you to pick one person to tell without expecting them to offer a solution. I have anxiety right now. Any moment, it might go again. That's the magic of life. You've been listening to The Space with me, your host, Casey Donovan. We're back tomorrow with another mood-boosting episode. How to buy happiness. Get your bank card ready. Until then, space out.